All right. Now, look, let's look at this. Moon's St. Jupiter acceleration. The moon's nearly circular orbit around the Earth has a radius of around uh, 384,000 kilometers. So pay attention to the unit. And a period of, uh, so, so this radius, uh, this is the radius, just put as R. And period of uh, 27.3 days. The unit is in day. Uh, this is the period. So find the centripetal acceleration of the moon towards the Earth. The so Earth is as like the center, yeah? Center of circle. Okay? Uh, the Earth is the center of circle. Now, um, all right. So, how to find the centripetal acceleration? AC's formula we have uh, v square over r. We have also r omega square and v omega. So, okay. So, we don't have omega, but we have the period, isn't it? Uh, we just have to change all to SI unit. The radius, the period, all to SI unit. Then the period, we can find omega using 2 pi omega equal to 2 pi over t. Then, problem solved. Okay? Okay, for, first of all, uh, let's find the omega. Okay, we don't have the omega. So, omega is... Uh, but no, we need to change the period into second first, uh, into SI unit. So, period is... Uh, Okay, period is the time to complete, time to complete uh, one circle, uh, the time, the time for one circle, the time for one circle, the time for one revolution is one period, okay, it's the period, the time to complete one circle, okay, that's the period, uh, the time to complete, the time to complete one circle. Okay, is period. So, uh, two hundred two uh, twenty seven point three days. So, uh, okay, let's think one by one. One day, how many hours? One day, how many hours? Twenty four hours. Right, twenty four. One hour, how many minutes? One hour, there is how many minutes? Sixty minutes. One minute has how many seconds? 60 seconds, that's right. So now let's calculate. Ah, so I got, you know what I got? I got, uh, I write all, yeah? 2, 3, 5, 8, 7, 2, 0. 2, 3, 5, 8, 7, 2, 0. Second, ah, okay? I got the period in second. So now, I want to find omega. Omega is 2 pi over period. Okay? You must have the period in SI unit first. Huh? SI unit first before you can substitute into here. So 2 pi over period. So, okay, let's just calculate. Uh, 2 pi divided by the, the period. So my omega is actually 2.66. 2.6638 uh, exponent negative 6 uh, radian per second. Ah, see, I got the omega already. So the next step is we use a formula r omega square because we have the r, we have the omega. Okay, and remember the R you need to change to SI unit also, kilometer to meter. Okay, now let's do it. Yeah, the R is uh, 384000. The kilo some more is exponent, exponent 3 uh, in meter already. Now, uh, omega is uh, 2.6638. 2.6638. Exponent negative six and negative six square. Don't forget the square. Okay, 
so uh, okay so multiply so what's what's the answer I get uh, let's calculate and see okay let's calculate and see the answer is 2.72 2.72 exponent Expo 2.72 exponent negative 3 negative 3 okay so the answer is uh, in meter per second square is the answer correct yes it is correct after checking so a big tick there all right very simple yeah just use r omega square omega is 2 pi over period Thank you.